Hello, my Virgos. How are we doing today? I am doing your reading for the month of June. Put a little check mark on you guys. I am burning some. I have a different mixture going on here. I have some sage, some lavender, some frankincense. We got it all, okay? Oops. We're going to start with some oracles for you guys. And we are going to... What are we going to do next? Do some tarot. Which deck do I want to use? Use that one. How's everyone doing? Everyone's doing well right now, or as well as they can be. Guys, when, before I did your reading, my candle went out. I just put a new one up. My the sage, the lavender, the brand, like none of it wanted to burn. Like none. I don't understand. So I don't know what that means yet. We're going to find out. Protect your home if you can. Words of abundance. You have the ability to instantly manifest by choosing powerful, positive words. Always describe your own. What? Always describe your own and the world's economic situation in loving and optimistic terms. Ooh. Like, I can't grasp onto anything for your reading and I just I haven't even started and that's what you attract for yourself and others I just want to show you this okay are you feeling frustrated I like suddenly started feeling a little frustrated about stuff about money oh wow okay that settles that so first couple arrow cards you got were savings. Basically save for your future and you'll be helping yourself. Okay. And your future self. Invest in yourself. And your other one is face your financial fears. I'm going to read this one to you because I forget what it says. When you're honest with yourself about your fears of success or failure, they can no longer control you. Be free of hidden fears by exposing them to the light and awareness. And you'll realize that, in fact, you have nothing to fear. And that every successful person has struggled and released these self-doubts. Okay? So you had this, which I think is pretty beautiful that you started with this, right? Savings and releasing of fears. Then you got these. Obstacles and blocks are lifted. Okay? Obstacles and blocks are lifted, followed by a raise or a promotion. So it's almost like, um, what is it called? Law of attraction, where your thoughts, you're manifesting them into reality. Which is really cool, actually. Think positive, you'll see positive. It's a good start. I'd say, excuse the look. Um, I was actually just doing someone's reading, the Cappy's reading, and uh, I kept getting phone calls. I'm on call for work. I work in a medical field, and I kept receiving phone calls during the reading. And earlier today, I was here. I was gonna start all these readings. And then I got called into work, so then I threw on the scrubs and headed over there, and then I got set back. So, this is why I'm in scrub. I wanted to get your readings done, so during I had this window here, I wanted to get them done. So hopefully I don't get any phone calls for your readings. If I do, bear with me. I'll pause the video, and we'll start from where we picked off. Picked up off of. Picked up off. I feel like I said that wrong. Picked up. Picked off. No. I don't know. We're just gonna. Virgo, the worst is over. That's your first card. Completion, cycles of completion. 
So you went through a lot of crap. Hard times. Those times are over. It's time for you to move forward into the next chapter in your life. You are no longer stuck. You are lifted of any delays that you had going on. I should have wrote the titles. I did not write titles. Damn. Virgo, if you're thinking about multiple things at once, I feel that. Um, some of you are not very too prone on commitment right now or religion in general. You made a decision not to be committed because you were previously heartbroken and someone was, there wasn't an equal give and take in there. So since you weren't getting that reciprocity, you decide commitment was not for you. There's lovers about making decision and there's your commitment. Also, even though this is not probably the case, um, religion could have taken a part into making your decision. But things had to be, things are getting, there's things that are, um, I cannot speak right now and I apologize. Anyways, things are being brought to light or they need to be brought to light. They're not being brought to light, but they need to be. Maybe you need to speak up since I can't speak right now during your reading. Or maybe, vice versa, maybe you're doing too, saying too much and you need to quiet down. Because I'm trying to speak, I'm trying to say stuff, and it's kind of like um, things are distracting or things are stopping me from saying the things I have to say. They make her tell me to shut up. Money's looking good for you, though. Okay, so you guys were in a period where you felt like you were out in the cold, but you're not there yet. So when you felt like you were being out in the cold, you actually, instead of, here's the heartbreak. Here's your heartbreak, right? Because of what I just mentioned. So someone felt like they were being out in the cold, but they're not anymore. So when they were out in the cold, they went, within and they found themselves see this is just snow here too. yeah there's snow here too so it's like they're walking to become this guy to find wisdom within juggling what are you juggling i don't really see much of juggling what's the two pentacles for Yeah, so when you went within, that's when you decided to let go of toxic situations. Because you saw, because someone was not being deceitful, or someone was being deceitful, and they thought that they can get away with stuff. See? And... They weren't telling you the truth. Oh, you have a king of swords and queen of swords, but they're both in reverse. So this was probably pretty ugly, to be honest with you. Like an ugly fight. You're both about your business, but none of you, you know, you don't, mm, there's the fighting. I found this coward, um, it was in the corner, and I happened to turn it over when I talked about it. This could get ugly. Ugly fighting. And it was basically because you or the other person didn't see, they weren't happy. They didn't see that life with the family and the stable foundation and 
everything that the higher font would provide. You didn't get that Google reverse. So it was time. One of you didn't want it to be just about sex. One of you, some of you might be actually expecting a baby though. Just side note, <laughs> side note, one of you might be expecting a child. Um, so yeah, basically one of you walked away. Another saw the truth of things finally. When you walked away, you became the hermit. And the hermit went to go find wisdom within and they came back and they're ready to let their guard down to accept new things in life. It's actually this way. I don't know which way I had it. Oh, no, it did have it the right way. But it required lots of patience. And required finding out the truth about things and cutting things out. Oh, in order to get inner fulfillment. Lots of male energy here. You have a higher font. They're all in reverse though. A king of swords, an emperor, justice. The hermit is a male, an older male. That's it. Lots of male energy. All right. What can we walk away with? Something. Wow, something just did a whole 360 flip in my deck. I don't even know what it was. What can we walk away with for our Virgos? This is all going to help you a lot, especially fun, um, financially. I don't know why I cannot speak during your video, okay? I've noticed it the entire video, and I'm so sorry. But financially speaking, materialistically speaking, another male energy, king of pentacles, king of pentacles, has the house behind, has the stability. So they come out of this. So, oh, there you go. So my question was, what do they come out of, come out with and stability? This is way too many cards. I'm not even taking that. Stability plans for the future. Plans for the future. There's your stability. In the background, you see the house. He has it all. Also, a buffalo or a bison. Um, when it comes to animal medicine, it has to do with working with spirit to accomplish goals. And uh, it's all about establishing family abundance and stuff like that. So... Like I said, abundance, stability, have the house, you have family. Any other animals in here? How did I pick up on that? New love. I meant, did I mention pregnancies in this one? The baby. Wasn't there a sun card somewhere? Yep. So for some of you, some of you find out about a pregnancy and that's what causes you anxiety, but it ultimately will lead to a new love or an, um, finding love. All right, final message for 
Virgos. And it's all because you put in the work. You work hard. Look, he's walking away with it now. He's accomplished. Things are all coming together. Okay? So, to sum this up, the worst is over. You have to go within and find yourself. As a result, you now will get to see your hard work turn into fruition. And you will have a stable foundation. And some of you a baby. If it's not a baby, it's new beginnings. And it's things coming to light. It's enlightenment about situations. And it has to do because you release yourself from toxic situations. And you cut things out that no longer served you. So you left all those burdens behind and you're walking forward without that weight on your shoulders okay um if you want a personal reading crystal things that he oh right crystal jesus you see i cannot speak work on your throat chakra because this didn't happen in any of the other readings it's happening with you guys a lot um crystal things heal.com if you want a reading if there's facebook crystal things heal um Etsy shop, if you guys want supplies or anything like that, I will have everything down below. I love you. Thanks.